no improvement. <laughs> this is awesome. <sighs> oh man, I need to pad my room when I get home. This is a blast. You, you there. I need your help. You must get word to my son. He's going to grow up and lead the rebellion against the robots. Please. Ah, <sighs> cartoons and lime jello. We can't think of any better way to spend, uh, whatever day this is, morning. <laughs> are, you, are you ready? Huh? Mm, ready for what? Are you, are you ready to go home? Huh? Huh? What? I can go home now? They're coming for us. <laughs> Oh, the mothership. I, I've sent word. They, they'll come and take us home. You'll see. <laughs> you, me, all of the aliens, yeah. We'll be going home soon. <laughs> wow. You're nuts. Hi, sweetie. How you holding up? I'm good. I'm peeing green, though. I think it's because of all the lime jello. I love it, but I kind of wish they had some other flavors. Hey, when can I come home? I miss you and Zeke in video games. I don't miss wearing clothes, though. Wearing pajamas all day is awesome. We've spoken to the judge and to the hospital administrator several times. They won't budge. They're not going to release you until they feel you won't be a danger to yourself or anyone else. Do you understand? Well, that's easy. I'm not dangerous, so can I go home now? You need to do whatever is necessary to convince them of that. That means acting like a normal person acts and doing it long enough so that they think you are a normal person. Okay, piece of cake. I can do that. Yeah. In the meantime, we'll keep talking to the hospital administration to try and get you released. Just hang in there, hun. We'll come visit tomorrow. <sighs> He'll never convince them. Nope. How do you feel today, Ethan? Good news, Doc. I'm not crazy or dangerous, so you can send me home. I see. And that makes you feel that you're not crazy? Hmm? Um, the part where I feel not crazy? Okay, you know what? This is going to take all day. Are you feeling angry that it will take all day? Mm, no. Can you speak without using questions? How else would you like me to speak? Hmm? Without questions? How do questions make you feel, Ethan? Ugh. Are you feeling upset? Hmm? No, I'm feeling like eating some jello. Maybe get a lawyer. Uh, I'm not sure how much that would help, and it would be expensive. Hello, and welcome to One Day Less in Your Lifespan. So what are we talking about? How to get Ethan home. I see. Well, that's easy enough. No, it doesn't seem that way. Sure. I'll head over there, smash a few walls, and then Ethan can come home. We don't want to make him a fugitive, Zeke. Really? Why not? Harrison Ford did pretty well at the box office when he was one. We need to convince the head psychiatrist to give Ethan a clean bill of mental health. Or as close to one as Ethan can get so that they'll let him go. Hmm. Nope, we'll handle it. It's under control. So we could try slipping Ethan some horse tranquilizers. He can't be crazy if he's not cognitive, right? I don't know. If I just blend in, stay unnoticed for long enough, they won't have anything to call me crazy about. I'm the wall. Keep walking. Damn, why does that never work? <sighs> okay. Okay, what about a bribe? How much money can you pull together? What makes you think he'll take a bribe? I still think my idea is the best bet we have. You want to stage an elaborate ruse in which Ethan saves the doctor's life, and then the doctor is so grateful he lets Ethan go? It works in movies! Uh, I don't know. This is just... What are you doing? What the hell is that? That's the head psychiatrist. What? 
Did you kill him? No, 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 no. Of course not. He's just unconscious. You said we needed to convince him to let Ethan out of the hospital, so let's convince him. I'll go get some jumper cables. No, this isn't... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I can't believe you did this. What? How? He can't be here. You can't... I don't want to be party to a kidnapping. Okay, okay. Uh, take him somewhere and leave him before he wakes up. He hasn't seen our faces or heard our voices. Well... He saw you? It's possible. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, when I grabbed him, he said, Oh, shit, a robot! But he may have been talking about something else. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. So did you learn a lesson at least? Of course I did. If you eat nothing but lime jello, you can start to hear the color green. That's all you learned? No, of course not. I also learned that padded rooms are a blast, and I want one. <sighs> Never mind. Bye, Doc! Thanks again! <laughs> I swear, I swear, abducted. Abducted by a robot. A robot! <laughs> Your robots, Your robots are coming! Take over! They will kill us all! I swear! Robots from the future! <laughs> <laughs> you druggie.